All right, so color optimization, what does it mean? Check this out, but to our eyes, the only things that are visible are between the spectrum of 400 and 700 nanometers. Before that, ultraviolet, after that, infrared. So the only things we're actually seeing is 400 to 700. What are the three main colors that our eye can only see? It's blue, green, and red. And depending on what surface they're standing on, we're right now talking about being on snow, the blue light is what's gonna be hitting us the most. So what's that gonna affect? If you're not wearing goggles and you're always looking at the blue light, and it's actually gonna be appearing white. So you're looking at snow, you don't think it's blue, but in reality it's reflecting the sky, which is blue. If you're getting too much blue hitting your eyes, what's gonna happen over time? It's gonna create a curtain effect, which we kinda of can see this right here. The moguls, the low spots, the hills, the shadows, the icy spots, too much blue light hitting your eyes is gonna not allow you to see the contrast of those things. So obviously as you're hitting, bombing down the hill, you're gonna not see those and be able to react as fast. So we remember it's blue, green, red, but it all has to do with where it's hitting the retina. And the blue light is actually hitting the retina in front of it, green light closer to the retina, and red light behind it. So we need to find a way to lessen the amount of blue light coming in. And that's exactly what we did right here by allowing just the perfect amount of blue light to come in so that we can clearly see the contrast. So what Outdoor Master has done is they found the perfect spot where these lights intercross and they're still allowing a little bit of blue light to come through while still letting the green and red come through. So now we want to break down is the testing that we put our lenses through to reassure that there's only a certain amount of blue lighting coming through. And we do that by using the light spectrum machine. We're gonna start out by comparing three of our competitors' lenses. All right, let's get started. What we're looking at here is the color spectrum of the white light evenly distributed all the way across. Competitor A, look what happens when, when they just make the whole lens tinted gray really bad. Totally saturating all the light, totally eliminating everything you need because you wanna be able to see the red and green still coming through. But now comparing Outdoor Masters lenses, check this out. Perfect amount of red light coming through, perfect amount of green, crisscrossing with the blue light and just dipping down right at the right spot. So it's gonna keep that the visual really nice. Why all these different lenses are different colors, that's actually the key. Outdoor Master having a pink tint to it, that is actually the key to reducing the blue curtain effect and enhancing the other colors specifically being the green and red. So it's gonna just be letting through just enough blue and enhancing the red and greens so that you can really see the contrast of the mountain. 